Can you can you please move? I get it. You're trying to be creepy. Hold on. Okay, we'll get that notification off. Mr. Flint sent a photo. It's gonna be a picture of one of the angels, isn't it? And then the angels gonna try crawling out. Okay. We shouldn't open it. I should just send this over to her. The angels got to play. All good. That was good. Sorry, I'm here. I couldn't just sit around after what well, you saw Aisha's feet. So I drove to West Brumlands in Lawrence's car. Good thing I swept the keys. What were you saying? Hey. The angel spoke to me as Flint. What? That's not good. I have to get there now. No, you don't. The building's alarm system has been activated. But I'd rather get in without everyone in the neighborhood knowing. Any ideas? How did Aisha get in? You could hack the security system. Go old school and climb over the front gate. How did Aisha get in? She never undertakes a mission without her jamming equipment. I had a quick rummage through her car for it. No luck. It must be in the house with her. Just spotted a retinal scanner at the gate. I can work with that with your help. Bring it on. How can I help? You need to get me an image of Flint. With that, I think I'll be able to reconstruct an image of his eyes and trick the scanner into letting me in. Find an image of Flint, got it. Okay, wait, where can I find that? I can get it off the profile picture from him calling me. There must be at least one image of him on Lawrence's phone. Just find one and scan it. I know you can do it. But please, you must hurry. Hmm. This photo? Was this taken after the angels? Poor man. Well, let's see if this gets us past the scanner. It worked! Okay. I'm going in. Be careful. It'll be fine. Yeah, that's what I eat you for. And what happened to her? I'm heading to the cellar now. I grabbed a camera from Aisha's car. I'll patch you in. That and the surveillance she set up earlier. So you can see. I don't want to see because they can come through the camera. Hey. Aisha. Aisha. She's a statue now. Please be okay. No, Please she's be. not. Angels feast on your friend. You sent her here, Petronella. Glad she's dead. Are you jealous of her as well? I would only wish death on my worst enemy. We're growing stronger. <laughs> Almost ready. And unfortunately for you, you're my worst enemy. Ooh. That's the time, Mrs. Wolf. Yeah, Mrs. <laughs> I need to get something from outside the house, but I'm afraid. Actually, I could just leave it there. <laughs> Petronella goes go to hell. I'm afraid you're going to have to guide <laughs> me out of here. Oh. Well. It'll be fine. I'm hence so we're off camera. This is bad. Very bad. Are you all right? What's going on? Can I help?
she's clearly not all right <laughs> thanks you see the thing is the angels are in the basement all of them i'm watching them so they're not attacking yet wait how are you texting osgood you're in huge danger what get out and barricade the door wait how are you texting probably not the thing to be asking right this second but whatever i'm using voice to text it's coming in really handy right now i'm not sure how long i can keep this up though but there's a way to stop them i need to do i need the disco ball in lawrence's car you're gonna boogie them to death like what how now's not the time for parties <laughs> right mm. why did this go well again to trap the angels in their own reflections yes i have to get it from the car but the angels will attack as soon as i turn my back can someone else get you the disco ball can you watch them with Aisha's cameras? Hmm? Oh, my word. Welcome to the I Have a Brilliant Idea Club. So, despite all the cameras inside the house, there are still some blind spots. Are there any cameras facing the house itself? Maybe we can rotate some of the cameras? I don't think I can do much remotely. Just a uh, general. Yes! You're a genius! We can use the cameras outside. The ones Aisha installed to keep watch for Flint and his contractors. You can control those cameras through my app. Just turn all the cameras inwards. RK Joe. Joker nine two two six. Joker. Joker nine two two six. Um, turn them all inwards towards the house windows. It's risky, but then I can probably monitor the angels whilst I grab the disco ball. But please hurry! I can't keep this up for much longer. Can I get this notification to go away, please? Shark Watcher Angel Joker. Ah, it's the camera names. Oh, great. Would have been useful if I listened to the feed, wouldn't it? Hmm. Oswald. Oswald. Oz. <laughs> Good. Right. Okay. Well, what about if I just. Oh, wow. They've got different names. Well, what was the first one? Hacks. Shark. One, seven, four, seven. Shark. One, seven, seven four, four, seven. Shark. One, seven, four, seven. Seven. One seven four seven. Watcher nine three two seven. Watcher nine. Yes. Three, I got two, that. Seven. Watcher. Watcher nine. Yeah, we don't need it again. Right. Lang. Lang la lang 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 lang. Angel. Five eight zero one Angel five eight zero one Angel And the last one Joker nine two two six Joker 
Nine, nine, nine two, two twos. Six. And a six. Yes, I can. Osgood, I'm too smart to need your help to get the cameras on. Because I already know the way in. Shark is one, seven, four. I went the long way. It's okay. I'm not the one who has to worry. Oh, it's quicker to use the arrows. Shouldn't I cover like multiple windows? Anyway. Watch here. Is nine three two seven. So nine. Three, two, seven. That looks like the street, so we need to go this way. Oh. Angel 5801. 5801. This is going to make me go off, isn't it? Which window does it want? Ah, that one. And the Joker is 9226. 9226. These cameras are pointing in really odd spots. I'm assuming this window? Yeah. You are too late. We cannot be stars. <laughs> Wait. What's the other message? No, if I can help it. Mr. Angel, Mr. Angela. Oh, that's offline. So, what's our notification saying? Standby for update from Osgold Scan So, it's a so Tadis. Doing this again? Really? Really? Your childish games. Wait, that just popped up. There. My head just, my head just popped. Right. We're just slowly go down it. Gently. Must have been picking up the bottom of it or the top of it. Yeah, it picks it up before it's even on screen. Interesting. You are too late, we cannot be stopped. Now, if I can help it, no one save you now. Well, I'm trying to read the rest of that. Tense music. Run! Run for your life! And have a disco party! Come on, come on, come on! Larry, I love you! Time to have a disco party with some angels! The doctor once said that courage isn't just about not being frightened. It's being afraid and doing what you have to do anyway. Which is good to know because right now I am very, very afraid. But are you petrified? Okay. I'm in. Yep. 
Oh, sweet, we get to watch the journey. Oh, why is it always the cellar? Oh, I don't know. Cellar. From the Latin, solarium, meaning the place where monsters hide. <laughs> oh, God, it's not really, sorry, distraction technique. It's a habit I got off the doctor. Trouble is, <sighs> it never works. I feel like if we're all still in the cellar, you just fail. Petronella goes to hell. Hello. Petronella goes to hell. If you're trying to scare me, you're doing a terrific job. Still jealous <laughs> of your sister, little girl, with her good looks and charm. She's no angel, <laughs> which is why I actually quite like her. Oh, you've been around time travel machine. Haven't you, Petronella? She likes to go out, though. Nightclubs, bars. Lots of yummy Artron energy on you. I'm more of a library girl myself. But we did go to the odd disco together. Artron energy makes angels nice and strong. Never liked the loud music. Strong enough to. But I always loved a your disco world. ball. My phone. <laughs> To save the planet with a disco ball. Oh, that is so the doctor. That's so <laughs> retro. Never mind, so the doctor. That is so retro. Right, as we were saying, no one can save you now. Your friends will be a tasty starter. Your world is ours. No. You do it. Are you alright? What's good? <laughs> Just catching my breath. So you're okay. <laughs> I'm alive! Anyway, so this go ball idea worked. The angels are frozen, trapped as long as it stays in place. Checkmate, angels! So, what happens now? I've informed units they'll secure the angels' property, and I'll have to break the news about Aisha. I mean, she didn't deserve that. She might be doing well in the past, too. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you. Without Aisha, the losses would have been incalculable. That's not true. You can technically calculate it, because we have a planet with a defined number of people on it. So that's the maximum that could have happened on our planet, at least. Anyway. I'll make sure her family knows that. What about Lynn's? What about Lawrence? Forget about Lynn. There was no sign of him. I think we'll just have to live in hope. But you've proven that we can all stand up to monsters no matter how terrifying they seem. Yes, love me a big one monster. Welcome to the fight. I'm almost certain now that the Doctor chose you for this mission because the Doctor always knows a good person when they see one. Thanks, Osgood. Osgood, after everything we've been through together, you can call me Petronella. Can't I just call you Pat? Well, I do did promise you we'd part ways once we are done. I imagine you got quite a bit more than you bargained for. In fact, you promised me a job. I remember rightly. It wasn't that bad, actually. I'd say that, yes. It wasn't that bad. Really? Yeah. It's fine. Huh? 
Maybe I'll call you again if I need a phone ring back. Um, you know what? Never call. Sounds good. I think my backup is on the way. I'd better go. Hey, it's been a pleasure. Catch you soon. Goodbye, Osgood. See you around. Let's never do this again. Um. Goodbye, Osgood. Goodbye. Ah, the doctor! You do know Osgood referred to you as he. That was like the first pronoun they referred to you as. And you don't look very he in this. Hiya! Just... It's the doctor. Don't worry. Not your doctor. The doctor. Phone in to say thanks for the work he did with Osgood. Top stuff. You were brave and dogged and whip smart and all those other words people thanks, want Jody. about me. Whoa. Sorry about that. Okay. Osgood's busy overseeing the cleanup operation, but she wanted you to know they're moving the angels from the basement to a top secret cell in the Black Archives. Okay. And if you were worried about Mr. Flint, don't be. Got to him in time, and he's making nah, a full yeah. recovery. He might still have a heart of stone, but the <laughs> rest of them is going to be flesh and blood. Oh, hold on. Again. Ah, ah, sorry. Console's playing up. Time for its 2,000 year MOT. Osgood thought you should know something else important. Who does the MOT? That which holds the image of an angel becomes itself an angel. Oh. So when Larry took pictures of them on his phone, that's how they were able to infiltrate it. But hey, you dealt with all that, and I think... Hello? Oh, I'm picking up a distress signal from the Bar Galactica, so I best be off. Mm. Just one last message from Osgood. She said if okay. you ever fancy working with her again, well, all you've got to do is pick up the phone. Literally. Oh, okay. about Larry, my old friend. I really hope he's going to be happy as, well, happy, happy as Larry. Larry. But I'm not sure what happens to him next. I don't know everything. Where'd be the fun in that? See ya. Okay. So that was Doctor Who, the Lonely Assassins. As you can see, Jodie Whittaker is the Doctor, as well as the many other people involved as well. I thank you for joining us on this journey. Hopefully you have a lovely night, and goodbye.